Hello, hello, shrimp enthusiasts, and all those captivated by the wonders of the aquatic world. Today, I invite you to dive into the thrilling world of aquarium shrimp breeding, where a term of great importance emerges, and some confusion, and that is culling. In the course of this video, we will explore the significance of culling when it comes to breeding high quality shrimp. But let's not forget that culling is not the be all and end all for those who simply enjoy the natural beauty of these enchanting creatures. Now, what exactly is culling? It is the, the deliberate removal of certain individuals from a shrimp population based on a specific criteria. These criteria could range from color patterns and health to overall vitality. The aim, you might ask, to refine the genetic pool and produce offspring that possess the desired traits, thus elevating the overall quality of the shrimp population. Culling plays a vital role in breeding remarkable shrimp. It allows breeders to carefully select and refine the genetic makeup of their stock, leading to improvements in color intensity, color patterns, and many other desired traits. By consistently weeding out shrimp that don't meet the desired standards, breeders can ensure that each new generation showcases the desired traits more prominently and consistently. It's important to remember that calling isn't the only path to appreciate these captivating creatures. Many shrimp enthusiasts find immense joy in observing their natural beauty without the pressure of intense selective breeding. Each shrimp with its own unique charm embodies a simple elegance unencumbered by the demands of genetic perfection. As we start this exploration of culling and shrimp breeding, let us embrace both perspectives. Let us admire the dedication and precision of breeders striving for perfection while cherishing the inherent allure of shrimp in their unaltered form. By finding a balance between these two realms, we can truly appreciate the diverse motivations and aspirations that drive the world of aquarium shrimp keeping. So join me in this captivating journey through the intricacies of culling and shrimp breeding while nurturing an unwavering appreciation for the natural allure that bring shrimp into our lives. So, Let's start by defining what exactly culling means in the context of aquarium shrimp breeding. Culling refers to the deliberate process of removing specific individuals from a shrimp population based on predetermined criteria. These criteria can vary depending on the breeder's goals and preferences. When it comes to shrimp breeding, culling involves carefully assessing the characteristics and traits of individual shrimp. This evaluation is often based on factors such as coloration, size, pattern, health, and overall appearance. Shrimp do not meet the desired standards set by the stand. The shrimp that do not meet the desired standards set by their breeder are selectively removed from their breeding population. The purpose of culling is twofold. One, to improve the quality and integrity of the genetic stock and to enhance the overall traits desired in the offspring. By removing shrimp that do not exhibit the desired traits, shrimp can ensure that the next generation carries forward the characteristics they are striving to cultivate. This selective approach aims to refine and enhance specific attributes, leading to a more consistent and desirable shrimp population over time. Calling is a meticulous and ongoing process. Breeders carefully observe and evaluate their shrimp, making tough decisions about which individuals to retain for breeding and which ones to remove from the breeding program. This continuous selection and culling process helps maintain and improve the desired traits in subsequent generations, ultimately leading to the development of high quality, selectively bred shrimp. While culling may sound like a rigorous and perhaps even harsh practice, it is essential for achieving the desired outcomes in shrimp breeding. It allows breeders to exert greater control over the genetic makeup of their shrimp populations, shaping them to meet specific standards and preferences. Now that we have a clear understanding of what culling entails, we can delve deeper into its importance in breeding high quality shrimp and how it contributes to the overall success and development of these remarkable creatures. 
Now, let's explore the importance of culling in the pursuit of breeding high quality shrimp. Culling plays a pivotal role in ensuring that breeders achieve their desired outcomes and maintain the integrity of their shrimp populations. Here are a few key reasons why culling is essential in this process. One, genetic improvement. Culling allows breeders to selectively propagate shrimp with desirable traits. By removing individuals that do not meet the desired standards, breeders can focus on breeding from a select group of high quality shrimp. Over time, this process leads to the refinement and enhancement of desirable traits, such as vibrant colors, distinct patterns, robust health, and desirable body shapes. Two, consistency. Culling ensures consistency in the offspring traits by eliminating individuals that exhibit undesirable characteristics. By removing shrimp with inferior traits, breeders can maintain a higher level of uniformity and predictability in the resulting generations. This helps establish a more standardized appearance and quality within the shrimp population. Three, even disease prevention. Calling is an effective measure to prevent the spread of diseases within a shrimp population. Shrimp that show signs of illness or susceptibility to diseases can be promptly removed through calling. By eliminating these individuals from the breeding program, breeders can, mat can minimize the risk of propagating genetic weaknesses or spreading diseases to subsequent generations. Four, Enhanced market value. Breeding high quality shrimp requires a meticulous approach to calling. By consistently producing shrimp with superior traits, breeders command a higher market value for their selectively bred specimens. Shrimp enthusiasts and hobbyists are often willing to invest more in acquiring shrimp with exceptional qualities, making calling an economically advantageous, advantageous practice for breeders. Breed development. Calling is a crucial for the ongoing development and improvement of specific shrimp breeds. Breeders can selective re selectively remove shrimp that do not conform to the breeds or lines standard characteristics, thus promoting the establishment and advancement of distinct shrimp varieties. Calling contributes to the creation of unique and sought after breeds or lines that enrich, the, that enrich diversity within the aquarium shrimp hobby. Through careful and intentional process of culling, breeders continuously refine and advance their shrimp populations, ensuring the highest standards of quality and desirability. It is this commitment to culling that allows breeders to produce remarkable shrimp specimens that captivate the attention and admiration of enthusiasts worldwide. However, it is important to note that while culling is integral to breeding high quality shrimp, it is not the sole purpose of keeping these captivating creatures. For those who for those who simply enjoy the natural beauty of their shrimp in their diverse forms, culling may not be necessary. Each shrimp possesses its own unique charm, un unburdened by the demands of genetic perfection, and can be admired and appreciated for their inherent splendor. It's worth noting that when it comes to culling and shrimp breeding, the majority of culled shrimp are not necessarily killed. Instead, they are often carefully separated and delegated to a separate tank known as a cull tank or sometimes referred to as a skittles tank. The purpose of the cull tank is to provide a dedicated space for the shrimp that did not meet the breeder's desired criteria. While these shrimp may not possess the specific traits the breeder is aiming to propagate, they can still thrive and lead fulfilling lives in their own right. In the cull tank, these shrimp can exhibit their natural beauty and behavior, coexisting in a community of fellow culled individuals. This tank serves as a sanctuary where shrimp enthusiasts can, instill the, can still enjoy the diverse colors and patterns of these unique, unique specimens, appreciating their individuality and the inherent charm they bring. Moreover, the cull tank serves another purpose. It allows the breeders to closely observe and monitor the cold shrimp over time. In some cases, shrimp that may initially be considered unsuitable for breeding due to certain traits or characteristics may display unexpected improvements or desirable attributes as they mature. This careful observation can help breeders make informed decisions about potential future breeding opportunities. By designated a separate cult tank, breeders demonstrate their commitment to both success of their breeding programs and the well-being of the shrimp. It showcases a conscientious approach that re respects the value of each individual, <laughs> each individual shrimp even if they do not align with the specific goals of selective breeding. 
in this way, the practice of calling on a more nuanced and compassionate dimension. It allows breeders to pursue their breeding objectives while still acknowledging and appreciating the inherent beauty and uniqueness of every single shrimp, regardless of their suitability for selective breeding. So while culling is an integral aspect of shrimp breeding, it is important to recognize that culled shrimp often find a purposeful place in a dedicated cull tank, where their natural beauty can be cherished, their behaviors observed, and their potential re-evaluated. Now let's shift our focus to an equally important perspective, the idea that culling is not necessary if one's goal is to solely appreciate and enjoy the natural beauty of shrimp. It's essential to recognize that not everyone who keeps aquarium shrimp aims to engage in selective breeding or achieve specific genetic outcomes. Here are a few reasons why culling may not be necessary in this context. Appreciation of natural diversity. Shrimp come in a wide array of patterns, colors, and characteristics that occur naturally. For those who find joy in observing the natural diversity of these fascinating creatures, there is no need for culling. Each individual shrimp, with its unique traits, contributes to the rich tapestry of beauty found in the aquarium. Embracing the inherent variations and celebrating the unaltered splendor of shrimp can be a rewarding and fulfilling experience in itself. Preservation of genetic variation. Allowing shrimp to express their natural traits without culling promotes the preservation of genetic variation within the population. Genetic diversity is essential for the long-term health and adaptability of a species. By refraining from selective culling, shrimp enthusiasts can contribute to the overall resilience and sustainability of the shrimp population. Maintaining a diverse gene pool that can better withstand environmental changes and challenges. A simplified approach. Not engaging in culling can offer a more relaxed and less demanding approach to keeping shrimp. By removing the pressure to consistently evaluate and select individuals based on specific criteria, shrimp enthusiasts can focus on creating a harmonious environment with their aquatic companions and simply enjoy the peaceful presence and beauty of these mesmerizing creatures. Personal enjoyment. Ultimately, the decision to cull or not depends on the personal preferences and goals of each individual shrimp keeper. For those who derive pleasure from observing and and appreciating shrimp as they naturally are. Without the desire to mold them to specific standards, culling may not be necessary. The primary goal becomes the creation of an environment where shrimp can thrive and be admired for their innate grace and charm. It is important to acknowledge that both perspectives, the the dedication to culling for selective breeding and the enjoyment of shrimp in their natural beauty are valid and contribute to the vibrant, diverse world of aquarium shrimp keeping. By embracing these different viewpoints, we can foster a more inclusive and rich community that celebrates shrimp in all their forms, whether they are selectively bred or simply cherished for their captivating natural allure. So, whether you choose to engage in culling or prefer to to appreciate shrimp in their unaltered glory, the beauty and fascination they bring to our aquatic landscapes remains undeniable. In conclusion, we have embarked on a journey exploring the multifaceted concept of culling and aquarium shrimp keeping. We have defined culling as as the deliberate removal of shrimp based on specific criteria, highlighting its role in refining genetic stock, producing high quality offspring. However, we have also recognized that culling is not necessary practice for those who simply seek to enjoy the natural beauty of these remarkable creatures. Culling holds great importance for breeders committed to achieving specific genetic outcomes, and it enables them to selectively propagate shrimp with desirable traits, ensuring consistency, preventing disease, enhancing market value, and advancing breed development. Through meticulous culling, breeders can create extraordinary lineages that captivate enthusiasts and contribute to the rich tapestry of shrimp varieties. It is equally important to acknowledge that not everyone's goals revolve around selective breeding. Those who find solace and wonder in observing the diverse beauty of shrimp in their unaltered form, culling becomes an optional practice. Each individual shrimp possesses its own innate charm, and their natural variations contribute to the richness and resilience of their species. Whether we engage in culling or opt to appreciate shrimp in their natural splendor, we can find common ground in our shared love for these aquatic marvels. 
The world of aquarium shrimp keeping encompasses a spectrum of motivations, from the pursuit of genetic excellence to the sheer enjoyment of their captivating presence. Let us celebrate this diversity of perspectives, fostering an inclusive community that embraces both the art of calling and the appreciation of shrimp and their unaltered beauty. By doing so, we can collectively enrich our understanding of these enchanting creatures and nurture a harmonious balance between selective breeding and the preservation of their natural allure. As we continue on our individual journeys within the realm of shrimp keeping, let us carry with the lessons learned today. Respect for the intricate process of culling, admiration for the awe-inspiring natural variations of shrimp, and an abiding passion for the preservation and growth of this extraordinary hobby. May the vibrant colors, graceful movements, and quiet resilience of shrimp forever captivate our hearts and remind us of the breathtaking wonders that nature has bestowed upon us. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.